This goes out to Tariq Nashi. Let me tell you something, brother, or sister, because I know you got to be a sister. <laughs> it's, I could tell a mile away. You know I know. Now, let me tell you something, Tariq Nashi. It's not nice when you speak about people. It's not nice when you t when you speak about other people's race. Like, why you got to make fun of this girl, that Puerto Rican girl? First of all, Tariq Nashi, she wasn't making no fun of you. She wasn't disrespecting blacks. She was not disrespecting black people. All she was saying is that black people always in the news, there's always violence, there's always this or that and the people in the media messing with the black people and the and the government messing with the black people and all and, and, and the crime that's going on with the black people. But it's all people. It's all people. Yes, she's probably a little stupid. No question about that. The way she came out, the way she's speaking with the yes, with the, with that little bullshit sweet whatever it is. But don't make fun of somebody's Heavenish, you know what I'm saying? Don't make no fun of, of somebody's grandmother, abuela. And it's abuela, not abuela. You understand what I'm saying, my brother? I mean, once again, my sister, because you are a fucking sister. You know, I know. All right? I mean, I mean, goddamn, even fucking Stephen Wonder can fucking hear you and know what the fuck you are. Tyreek, Nashi, you are a fucking grown man. So act like a fucking grown man and stop acting like a little bitch. You heard Tariq Nashi? Because let me tell you something. Yes, that girl is kind of ignorant. Yes, she is. Because, I mean, come on. All Puerto Ricans don't speak like that. Like the way she's speaking. All right? Fuck that hooker. It's not all about that. It's about you disrespecting the Puerto Rican people. All right? Look, me, myself, and I, I am, I am tired of people announcing me as a racist. I also have a page on YouTube, and constantly, blacks call me racist, all right, constantly, and I, you know what I say about that, they just don't know me, but they, they will know me, they will love me, they will know that I'm not racist, I live in the fucking, in the Bronx, in the Bronx, I was born around blacks. And I always said this, blacks, Puerto Ricans are blacks. Yes, yes, our island was controlled by the Spaniards. Yes, our island was controlled, yes. And what happened? When they started killing the Taino Indians, because they started killing them, and they started killing themselves because they couldn't take it no more. You understand what I'm saying? They couldn't take it no more. They killed their own self. Because they didn't take it no more. They didn't want to live in that fucking slavery world. Now, I could come out and say something stupid and say at least my people had the nerve to fucking kill themselves, to kill themselves and fight back. What did your people do? What the people in Africa did? Nothing. All they did was selling out their motherfucking own brothers and sisters. Clams having war with other clams. Tribes having war with other tribes, catching them, taking them a hostage, and selling them to the motherfucking um, the oh uh, god, what was the names uh, the, the name of these people, man, the Portuguese, selling them to the Portuguese. And if if, if it's not the Portuguese, it's my mistake. But they were selling them all over, Americans, the British, they was all going to Africa, and then they had to grab no more or oh, 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 or kidnap black people no more. Because they was already kidnapped by the tribes. And the tribes were selling them to the fucking other, to the, to the Europeans. So before you speak about another culture, look at your culture. And, and being deep down inside, man, this is the same shit. That goes on around and around with the slavery shit and this and that. Let me tell you, my brother, we all the same people. Making fun at a Puerto Rican girl, the way that she's speaking, yes, she's integrated. Once more time, yes, she, she all Puerto Rican people don't sound like her. 
She's trying to be somebody that she ain't. Yes, I agree with you 1,000%, my brother. Excuse me, my sister. Tyreek, not chic. Watch your mouth. Too much cock loving is not a fucking... Let me rephrase that because I'm coming out, out of my face and that's, and that's not me. That's not me. Let me rephrase that. Just watch your mouth, man. I don't know where you from, where you come from, and I don't give a fuck if this going to give me any problems. I don't care. You have racism in every damn culture. Puerto Ricans, blacks, Chinese. We already know about the whites. So come on. It, it takes people like me, like you, to stop that. Stop that. Instead of you coming out and saying, well, you know, all Puerto Rican people don't speak like this girl, you know, and blah, blah, blah. And like all black people don't think like you think, Tyree, not she. So please, don't be doing that, man. Don't, don't, don't. Yesterday I heard you talking about, about blacks. Dressing up like slaves. Yes. Yesterday, this man on the fucking YouTube talking about blacks dressing up like slaves and making fun of them. I caught your little show for a couple of minutes. Yo, I'm just tired of this fucking bullshit with Puerto Ricans and blacks Dominicans, I am tired of this, man. We are the same people. Dominican, Puerto Rican, black, black, Dominican, Puerto Rican, Puerto Rican, black, Dominican. We are the same people. We bleed the same blood. We all look alike. We all come from the same fucking ghetto. Tyreek. Nashik or Miss Tyreek Nashik because I know I know you got sugar in your tank so I'm not even going to say that but what is the problem with you and these women bro you talking about that girl like you really hate her why you want to be her you hate her because you ain't her that's what it is. You hate her because you ain't her. Wow, man. This gets me so, so upset, man. For two days, I've been getting this bullshit. Oh, you, you, you racist. Oh, you this. Oh, you that. And then I'm hearing this brother here, or this sister here, talking about, about Spanish people, Puerto Ricans. Wow, he don't even try to put no shade on that. He not even trying to put no fucking shade. I know this fucking cow is not from New York. Because if he was from New York, he would never speak like that, man. Tariq, not chic. Should be ashamed of yourself. For real, old jokes aside. Wow, man. I'm going to come back. I'm going to come back and make another fucking video about this. Another video about this. This is my second video about racism. And now this fucking guy. Can't believe this, man. I can't fucking believe this, man. In fucking New York, in the 2020, we got to go through this racism shit. People accusing me, brothers accusing me of being racist. And then you got brothers like this guy right here, Tariq Nashik, that he don't even put no shade on it. Talking about that woman like that. Yeah, that woman is kind of stupid. Yes, no Puerto Rican speaks like that. Wow. Wow, man. This is fucking crazy, man. I just don't. I just can't comprehend this, man, that, that we going through this shit at 20, in, in the year of 2020, man. 
Why we got to hate? Why we got so much hate in our blood, man? Why? Why you got people that are hating on other people? People that just don't, don't, don't understand, man. God, man, why, man? Why, why, why must we treat each other like this, man? Why we, why we, 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 we look at another Spanish man or we look at a black man and we get scared of them or, or, or we, we don't want to be a part of that. Oh, we try to hide that. We try to hide ourselves. Oh, I'm not Spanish. I'm not Puerto Rican. Uh, I'm not black. Uh, I'm mixed. I, I got blood. I got white in me. You know, come on. Be proud of who you are. I am damn proud of who I am. I am a black man, Spanish man, and Indian. You mix that together, you get a fucking Puerto Rican. And I am proud to be a Puerto Rican. 100%, bro. When I hear people like you speaking, it, it, it just kills me. It kills me. And when I hear people talking about me that I'm racist, like that fucking clown three weeks ago that made a video of me, he only got 400 subscribers. I mean, 400 people that watched that fucking... That, that, that what I call fake ass news, fake ass Rick Ross looking motherfucker. Yo, man, this is Case Solo, man, and I just don't. This kills me, man. It kills me that we have people like this guy right here. And it kills me that we have white people, black people, Spanish people. Still talking amongst each other like they hate each other. And that's and that's the devil's work, man. That's the devil's work. To make us go at it with each other. And you falling into their plan, my brother. You falling into their trap. You didn't you ain't falling, you fell in their trap. Mr. Tariq Nakshik. Tariq Nakshik, if I'm saying your name right. And I'm calling you Mr. because I'm coming here with the most respect again, with the respect that a man deserves. And, I, and, and if I came out of the wrong, I'm sorry, but the, the, the milk is spilled already. So what can I do? Nothing. I already called you this. I already called you that. I already disrespected you. And that's what the devil wants. And I take it back. I am sorry. But please, don't do things like that, my brother. Don't make fun of the Puerto Rican woman. Don't make fun of the Puerto Rican man. I don't do it. And maybe she's naive. Maybe she's naive that she doesn't know the real truth. But it's the damn... I mean, if you hear her speaking, all she's saying is what's happening to black people in America. I don't think she meant anything wrong by that. And if it came out wrong because of the way she speaks and you don't like it because you want to be her and you're not her, don't blame every Puerto Rican. Blame your family for having you. For having that boy. And act like one. Because goddamn, nobody needs to see you and know what you are. All they got to do is just hear you and already know what you are. This is Case Solo, man. I'm tired of this shit. Enough is enough. Enough is enough of this racist stuff. Please, man, my brothers and sisters, let's try to get along with each other, man. Remember that? Let's get along with each other. Ronnie King. Let's so. Let's just chill, man. Let's just chill and stop this bullshit. You got people fighting amongst each other, podcasts. You got people fighting amongst Twitter. And that's all they want to see. They want to see me talking about you. They want them to talk about you. They want to see you talk about me. And we falling into their trap. Big times. This is solo, man. This is me, K-Solo. 
and I was not going to say the story, man. I was going to come up with some crazy story that I did. Look at this. I'm hearing the news, and all I'm hearing is African American. It's crazy. I'm listening to the news right now in the living room, and I'm hearing African American. Let's speak of African American at four o'clock. It's, it's just crazy, man. It's just crazy. Don't you see what the media is doing to us? The media is dividing us little by little. This damn president is doing it to us. I'm seeing Spanish and black people liking this president, liking Trump. I spoke about that, and nobody wanted to listen to that video. I hope they listen to this one, and, they, and if they do listen to this one, I know what they're going to say. Oh, this nigga solo is racist, oh, but, but I know that's how, that's how it's going to come out. That's how it's going to come out. And you know what I got to say? Those are naive people. So please, my brothers and sisters, have more respect for each other, okay? And Mr. Tariq Nakshi, sorry about that, but I don't like when you talk about my people like that. And my people is that Spanish people, Puerto Rican people, and blacks, and white, and Oriental. I love all men. I love all women. I love all people. Let's stop this, man. Let's stop this hate. Let's show the people, these mother, these 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 rednecks that that are racist. Let's show them that Spanish and blacks could get together as one and overcome whatever's coming our way together as one. This is me, K Solo. This is Rikers Island Stories, the AKA K Solo Show. I'm sorry. Just don't like this. I didn't like what he was saying, the way he was saying it. Peace.